I don't even know where to start with this film. It was so powerful and so moving. And you guys just did such a fantastic job. Um, maybe we'll start with Anne. I, I know when you read the script, you said that you had kind of two key things that floated through your head. Can you share with me what those were? Certainly. The, the first was knowing I would do it, certainly. And the, the actually in my head is who could ever turn this down? And the second part was, how do we live in this level of grief for the time we will shoot that would really uh, honor the and respect the character and those in life who are who have been so tragically uh, affected by these circumstances. Sorry, yeah. that wasn't very articulate, but go ahead. <laughs> and and read the interesting thing was Fran Fran wrote this role for you. Talk to me about what did the conversations look like prior? Or did did you know that what was going on? I did not. Um, I had met Fran socially in probably around um, I want to say 2012, maybe maybe later than that. Um, and we liked each other a lot. We never worked together. I went to see him and stuff, and he came to see me and stuff. But it was really just a, a, a you know, New York actor colleague thing. Um, I had a couple of fun nights at a bar with him, you know, along the way. But uh, I, out of the blue, I get an email from him saying, um, here's this thing I've written for you. It was a play at that point, and um, I didn't know he wrote. I don't think he knew he wrote. And uh, all of a sudden, there was this gorgeous play um, that I dove right into. I called him the next day and said, I'll, I'll go anywhere to do this. And he, I think he tried to get it on as a play a little bit and realized it was going to take time the way plays work. And I said to him, and Casey Mott, our producer, also said to him, make a movie. Do it as a movie. And the next thing I knew, he was. It, I mean, in no time at all, he said, we're going to film this thing. So yeah. it was miraculous and unexpected and completely thrilling. One of the things that I find so fascinating is we have we have four parents, two couples, and they're brought together, you know, both suffering from the loss of a child, but in very different circumstances, correct? One as, you know, um, the shooter and the other as the victim. And I had very different reactions to each of the four of you um, based on just, you know, your, your facial expressions, your body language, the way you responded to things. And I love that I had to rely only on your conversation. There were no flashback sequences. I was at the table. Um, talk to me about what it was like, you know, transforming into these individuals. It was uh, extraordinary, really. We had two and a half days to get to know one another a few weeks before shooting. Um, there was, I would say, almost immediate connection and trust. We both, all of us loved and respected the writing of this script, we all wanted in, were in, and we knew what the level of commitment was. We knew how rare and special something mm -hmm. like this was. Mm -hmm. Does not happen ever that you find a piece that's written this beautifully. And very quickly on, we, we realized that we were with some master actors together to I think create too, this thing. Yeah, and, and uh, We've done it for a while now, you know, acting, so to speak. Well, yeah. he Reed is new at it. Um, <laughs> you know, he's a newcomer. We're, but we're I'm learning. Him. I'm he's learning. <laughs> but uh, we 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 knew what we had to do, mm. and what it would need, what what was required of us as human beings and as actors. And uh, it was a gift. We really, were all in. We, you we know, were all we, in. We don't get the opportunity to play parts that are really about the acting. It's not about anything except the four of us creating this world. And uh, it's the kind of project that we all dream about as actors to get, well, and it happened. There's universal concepts that, you know, we're, we're, you know, digesting. I have two kids. So when I see you and talking about the parenting and navigating the best way that we know how, and you don't know how your child's going to turn out. I mean, that's something that resonates with all of us at our core. So maybe talk about the universality of that. And then also that you, you can't change something and, and, and grappling with that too. 
Yes. Uh, first of all, thank you for expressing the, what you just said. Uh, yes, the as parents, uh, gosh, the idea of ever losing one of uh, our child, um, and also for missing something so profound, so that how did I how did I miss this? Why didn't I see that this was not he was not going in a hopeful direction? You know, uh, I I look back honestly. I've told my daughter this and my boys too. The times I was slightly not paying enough attention, and one of them might have tripped. That haunts me to the tripped. Okay, they're fine. Yeah. yeah. Uh, how much <sighs> the profound knowledge of what we are responsible for, and the preciousness of life, and the sacredness of motherhood or parenthood. It's everything. Uh, at the end of the day what's most important. But also, as <clears throat> you don't have to be a parent. True enough. We all mm -hmm. have things we have not forgiven in other people. Mm -hmm. And we have things that we have done that we want to be forgiven for. And so mm -hmm. as much as it's about what Annie says about parenting and missing and the guilt and shame, it's also about how do we as human beings try to move forward carrying this stuff and finding a way to maybe let it go or realizing I can't let it go and um, I need you help. Know, yeah, everybody help everybody has you can't be alive without having stuff that you are mad about and hurt about and the power of forgiveness and what that looks like and is it needed and how does it change your personal perspective and shifts I just feel like the film brings about so many, so many really great conversation starters. And it was a privilege to get to sit while you guys acted and did that. So thank you so much for taking the time today. I can't wait for people to see it. Aww, thank you, sweetheart. Thank Good you. luck to you.